Okay, uh, looks like uh, Autodesk made a few changes to some default settings in Maya as in for 2020, Maya 2020. And these new default settings are causing problems with Maya Star. And so I want to go over this video and I want to go over these settings so that you can change these settings so that once you change them, you don't really have to worry about them again. Okay, so the first thing is what will happen if you don't change these settings. Um, if you go to female walk and you go to play the animation, you see her arms get messed up. Okay, you see they're all messed up. Now, the reason for this is that the Maya Star's animations were all made at 24 frames per second. And because that's what Linden Lab originally created these animations at, um, all these walk animations and all that are all from Linden Lab's default avatar. And they did it at 24 frames per second, which was probably the standard back then. Um, but I guess finally Autodesk decided to make their default 30 frames per second. And so um, you may have noticed when you've, when you've Myasterized uh, a, a dev kit avatar body, um, that you got a warning at the top that, that said, hey, you know, the imported uh, files animations are at 24, uh, but your, your setting is at 30, so there might be some problems. And that's the problem. <laughs> so, um, okay, it's really easy to do. Uh, before you my star is anything, make sure you look down here and you change this to 24. Okay, you can also change this by going to your... Um, so you go to your settings and preferences, preferences, and then coming down here to time slider and changing the, the frame uh, rate from 30 to 24 and click save. Okay, so that way whenever you have a new a new a new uh, scene start, it will be on 24 frames per second and you'll be set. You won't have to worry about it. Um, so, cause yeah, if that's set at 30, which is the new default, this will always be set at 30 and you'll be like, oh, it's not working right. So, okay. So that's one setting. Uh, another setting is in the import. So I'm going to import a, a dev kit body. Okay. I'm going to import it. Now you'll notice that when I imported it, this is another setting you got to look out for. When I imported the dev kit body, it changed it from 24 frames per second to 30 frames per second. And that's a problem. You know, now I could myasterize this. I could change this to 24 frames per second manually and then myasterize it. Um, I'm going to go over, you know, I'm going to do the dev kit prepper. It's going to give me an error. And that's because I imported the body and uh, the dress at the same time. So there's two different poses in there. So I'm going to show you how to fix that real quick, even though the instructions for that are right there. Uh, I, you turn off DAGs only. So you come in here, turn off DAGs only, and you just type in bind, B-I-N-D. And there's the two. And make sure that there's at least one that says bind pose one. If it says like three and four, uh, you delete four and you rename bind pose three to bind pose one. But in this case, we do have bind pose one, so I'm just going to delete bind pose two. Then you hit the dev prepper again, and we didn't get an error. So, um, and then we can go myasterize female bento myasterize. Okay, and we can go to female walk, and that's the other thing. This seems to, oh, there it goes. Sometimes there's a little bit of delay, but now we don't have the arms folded because it's at 24 frames per second. Okay, so how can we avoid that? Okay, how can we even avoid that so that we don't have to, um, so let's go new scene, don't save. Okay, so if you go to your import, 
and go to your DAE FBX and you scroll down. I don't know why it stops. Let me show you how to drag that down. Where is it? Oh, that's because I haven't selected a, a file, I guess, yet. There we go. Not all the options were there until I selected the file. So what you want to do is you want to turn off animations. Now what I did is I just set this to the same as the other settings where I left it on and I turned off blend shapes and I turned off lights and cameras and audio and I, you can leave this stuff normal as that's fine or you know uh, but I, I just turned off lights and cameras and made sure it's set the skins and I turned off blend shapes you don't have to have that on um, uh, or you don't have to turn that off but I just do anyway and then I turn off animations so now it's not going to import any animations not that I exported out any animations uh, when I made this DAE um, and then if I go import now and see it stays at 24 frames per second okay and then if I go to uh, that dev kit prepper see it's telling me the same thing and so I just go find newer versions or older versions of mine you might have to put a hashtag find hashtag um, to find it to have them pop up a hashtag is the um, little star thing above the letter is it what letter is it six is it let's see which letter is it no it's not six I think it was eight yep it was eight Okay, so, so you hold down the shift key and you press the letter 8 on the top of the keyboard, not in the number pad, but, you know, above the letters to get that hashtag, and that acts like a wild card, and so it would it would pop up. So if you're using an older version of Maya, you'll have to do that, B-I-N-D, and then a um, little hashtag. Newer versions of Maya, you don't have to do that, you just put B-I-N-D in there. I'm going to delete 2, and then I can run the dev kit prepper again and got no errors okay and now I can convert to female pinto moisturize okay and if I come here to uh, say female lock and go play oops come on, there we go and click it a couple times now everything is fine um and I don't think it fixed the female sit. Come on, female sit. Okay, you're going to have to do the other thing. They made a few changes to my 2020. Um, so that the um, play pause doesn't always work. I'm going to have to fix that in the next update. Um, so if the play pause button doesn't work after you click click on female set, just come in here in the um, timeline and just drag it anywhere, and then it will work. Okay. Um, so female log. Everything works okay so that's it it was just a couple of, of settings um, and then once you get those down you shouldn't have the problem with the at least with the animations coming in properly um, that you did that you had before so um, yeah wonderful Maya just love it when they change the default settings because uh, it's been 24 frames forever through 2019 and they guess they decided to make the default uh, frames 30 so, um, but yeah, like I said, just change it in your preferences and then, um, and then mind you when you import something that you have animations turned off. So if you're importing an FBX file, if there's, um, if there's an option to import animations with FBX, um, make sure you just turn, you have that animations turned off. So it doesn't change the, the, uh, the frames over down here. So awesome. All right. We'll see you in the next video.